What's going on everybody? It's Erica with Not Your Average EDC. On my break at work, figured I'd make a quick video because I don't think I'll have time when I get home. We have two topics to address today, but first, let me just show you what I'm carrying today. Native 5, Salt, and LC200N. Um, I'll do a week one update this weekend on this knife. Um, spoiler alert, this thing is the shit. I am obsessed already. We'll go into more detail on the weekend, but um, that's the work knife. Sorry, I just burped. Um, and then the fixed blade that we're using today is the Bark River. I believe it's called the North Country EDC. It's honestly big for an EDC knife. However, it's freaking amazing so far. You can see it's already scratched up. I've only used it uh, today, but use your shit. Really nice fixie in CPM 154. So this is um, getting some use so that I can make a video on it as well. But we are not talking about these today. We are top topping. <laughs> we are talking about two important subjects. Number one, the knife sale that'll be running Thursday into Friday this week. Number two, China. Let's talk about the knife sale. So first things first, the, the knife sale is not live yet, guys. Um, the only person that has been able to purchase a knife beforehand is Steven over at Talica because um, he has a special place in my heart and I let him have first dibs because I get to choose favorites. So he uh, got to pick up one of the knives beforehand. Nobody else is going to be able to do that. You have to wait until I post the sale on my Instagram on Thursday night. I'll be posting it like Thursday afternoon slash night. That way, hopefully everything gets bought and Friday morning I could, I could ship it all out at the same time um, because I have Friday off. So don't DM me about shit yet. I won't be answering. Um, I will post what is for sale on Thursday night, okay? Um, with that being said, I'm selling... I'm selling a lot of my fixed blade collection. Like, there's nothing you can say to stop me. Um, please do not start up a GoFundMe. Please do not send donations. Please do not ask if you can buy a knife and have me keep it. Obviously, I am so blessed to have that many people reaching out. I mean, I've I, my phone was going off the entire night with people asking what they can do to help. Um, I either want you to buy a knife so that you're getting something in return or I want you to just send good vibes. I don't want your free money. I don't want a donation. That's not how I work. Here's the thing. I live on planet Erica. Nobody else lives here other than me. Like I am on a planet by myself because I'm crazy and nobody else is there other than me. And um, I do a lot of weird stuff that people don't understand. I don't like being given things unless I've earned it. I don't like free stuff. I I don't like money. I, um, yeah, uh, it's, a, it's a weird planet that I live on, but it's just, it is what it is. And um, I, I don't want donations or anything like that like just buy a knife I want you to have something in return and like for me this is how my brain works on planet Erica the I did not get the money I was supposed to get the ten thousand dollars and that to me is a sign from the universe that I need to do something to get that money now and um it was a sign that I need to sell off a lot of my collection because I have too many knives and I can share them with people that share the same passion as me. So, like, I I love BGM knives. I, I have bought hundreds and hundreds of dollars of BGM knives over the years. Like, the amount of money I have given John for his knives is insane. Um, I love them, and to be able to share those with you guys at a discounted price, because I'm, I'm marking them down because, number one, I've used them, and number two, I need to move this stuff quick. So the, I said this in my prior video, the prices are going to reflect me needing to move stuff quick and get some cash. Um, but I, I, want, I do want to share that with you guys. I think it's great that um, his books are pretty filled up right now, and I'll be able to, like, give a couple of people, like, a a decently priced BGM knife to try, that makes me happy. And it's just the universe telling me I have too many knives. I have too much stuff. I, I, I need to sell them at this point to get the money. Um, I don't want anybody giving me anything for free. I, I, I do, I guess the universe is telling me I need to earn that. Um, yeah. 
and I, I can't go into detail about what happened. So many people are asking what happened, if I'm okay. Like, that's a large amount of money. How were you even involved in that? It, it's totally fine, guys. It was a, a, a personal thing. And I, I just don't want to say too much about it because it doesn't matter. All that matters is it, it didn't work out like it was supposed to. And I'm going to bust my balls to get that money. Like, I don't give a shit that it was taken from me, that it was robbed from me. I am going to make that money on my own. I can do it. I know I can. I can do anything. Um, so, yeah. Thank you, everyone that has reached out. For the few people that... Uh, did not listen to my words in the video and just want a knife, like, save your messages because I'm not even going to answer you. Uh, there were, like, three people that were like, hey, um, I'm sending you $300 for your mini A100. Like, I never said that was for sale. I never once said I'm selling the mini A100. Um, yeah. <laughs> Some people just don't listen. But, um, for the most part, like, 99.9% .9 of people have been so incredible, so gracious, so wanting to help the cause um and good karma comes back around so i just i want you guys to buy the knives i want to give you guys stuff that you enjoy um that's what i'm supposed to do now speaking of planet erica where i live and nobody else does and i have crazy fucking beliefs like i'm not being sarcastic right now like i live on a planet within earth where i have beliefs that are crazy to most people and they don't make sense so Tons of DMs lately and comments have been saying, when are you going to test a Kaiser blah, blah, blah? When are you going to test a Wee Knives banter? When are you going to... Here, I'm going to send you this CRKT da, da, da. Um, so here's the thing. On Planet Erica, there's a... There's an allergy. And I'm allergic to Chinese knives. Um, if I even touch them, I get nauseous. And then if I use one, I'll break out in a rash and like hives. And I'm going to start vomiting. So, um, I'm actually allergic to knives made in China. I'm allergic to, um, communism and, um, yeah, so I can't do that. And I actually never will on this channel. Not only am I allergic to Chinese knives, but it's also against my belief system, um, the EDC hobby is, is, is something that I'm very passionate about. And my belief has always been like, basically my belief has been that one day, if I choose something that I'm so passionate about and I put all my good energy into it, good things will come of it. And I can't, I can't change the world. I cannot, at this point in my life, I cannot, um, buy all of my clothes and everything that I own from places other than China, like some of my stuff, unfortunately, my wardrobe, some stuff is made in China and like my shoes, but I'm trying to take it one step at a time. And, um, the knife hobby is something I'm so passionate about. And I do have a choice whether to buy Chinese knives or like American or whatever. So for me, number one, I'm allergic to Chinese knives. And number two, uh, by choice, my choice for me, and it's a crazy choice, is to not buy Chinese knives. Um, I will buy from Germany, Switzerland, Italy, America. Obviously, all my knives are American for the most part. But I'm not going to give China my money for knives. Um, it's just never going to happen on this channel. Like, on this channel, you will never see a Chinese knife being reviewed, looked at, first impressions... Um, it's never going to happen and nothing against people that do that. Nothing against the big YouTubers that have 35 Chinese knives come through their hands every week that they look at, flip open a few times and do a review on. Um, nothing against that. Like you guys are normal. I'm the crazy, I'm weird. I'm literally weird and I'm allergic to Chinese knives and I cannot even think about using one because this is my passion EDC is my passion. Knives specifically are my passion. And I can't use a Chinese knife like it'll make me sick to my stomach because that's something I do have a choice in right now. I, I have just enough money where I can choose to buy American or Chinese and I will definitely buy American. Um, 
Unfortunately, I have Chinese flashlights, which I hate, and I have thought about giving them away and just going with, like, Surefire because they're American. Um, but then I would only have one flashlight. So, like, I'm I'm chipping away at it. I don't have any Chinese multi-tools. I don't have any Chinese knives. I, I only have Chinese flashlights, and that's something I'm working on. But one step at a time, and um, as Super Steel Steve said on his latest video, when you buy a knife from China or anything, really, um, you are paying the Chinese Communist government to put bullets through your head. You are. Every time that you buy something from China, I don't care what you say, I don't care if I lose all my subscribers for saying this, you paying China to manufacture something that you want is paying the Chinese Communist government to literally put a bullet right through your head in three years. And your brothers and sisters that are in our armed forces. Um, and I believe that. I believe Steve. I am 100% with him on that. If I could right now do that and make everything that I own and wear uh, come from places other than China, I would. Unfortunately, I don't have that superpower yet. It's not available on my website on Erica's Planet. But um, hopefully at some point it will be. But right now, my, my main focus is knives only American-made knives, only American-made multi-tools, only American-made um, pry bars and beads and anything anything in the EDC community that I can get that is American-made or made from a reputable country, I will. Um, so, yeah, everyone that gets Chinese stuff 24-7 in the EDC community and says... Uh, that it's because it's cheaper and they, that's all they can afford right now. That's just like, I get that. Um, I, I totally understand not everyone has a budget to buy American made. And that's why like I live on planet Erica where I am literally a crazy person and make no sense. So, um, yeah, just wanted to clear that up. Um, I don't have health insurance, so I really can't afford to get nauseous and get a rash from touching the Chinese knives, uh, on this, on this channel. I think that's it, guys. Um, keep an eye out for the knife sale Thursday night on my Instagram. If you don't follow my Instagram, it's the same exact username as my YouTube channel. So you can just go there, follow me. I'll be posting. I'm figuring they're going to go pretty quick because I'm going to price them to sell. Um, they, like I said, there's BGMs. There's an LT right. I'm selling the Lanny's clip. That is a knife that I already tested. It was it was bought for me for $491 from Case. I sent the same amount of knives, like the same currency, uh, to the person that bought it for me. So it was like an even trade because they didn't know I was selling them knives in exchange. Um, I have said numerous times that the Lanny's clip, in my opinion, because of the fit and finish, is only worth $100, even though it was $491 from Case. So I'll be selling it for $100. I've said, like, two or three times I think it's only worth $100. So, um, yeah, uh, it'll be up for sale for $100. The steel is the best I've ever used on it. It's just the fit and finish is, like, not that great. Doesn't affect it, obviously. I ran it for 30 days, and it had zero issues. And the steel is, like, out of this world. So, um... Yeah, the Lanny's clip will be going up. Uh, I'm not doing any other folders yet, really. I'm going to try to do it in sections. I think that'll be easiest for me um, with shipping and everything, just doing sections of stuff going up for sale. Um, yeah, I think that's it, guys. I will see you guys on the next video. Go use your shit. Um, if you feel like trying to visit Planet Erica where morals come first um you could we are the mi minority here but um i do like friends i like visitors i guess if i'm feeling social so feel free to visit erica's planet where we use american stuff and don't do things for money um love you all I will see you on the next video. Go use your motherfucking shit. Oh my god, I'm already sounding like an alien. Ugh. Go use your shit. See you on the next video. Or in another lifetime. Bye.